Hello everybody, Burnt Dope Guy here, and welcome back. Alright, so we're doing another Stationeers uh, video, so we're episode number four, I believe. So uh, I've been slowly taking this stuff down, because uh, we're going to have to start expanding our base a little bit. And you notice how I put them down onto the platforms. Well, kind of have no choice, because uh, guess what? They added elements to the game. Oh my, jumped up Jupiter. Oh man. That sucked. I ended up having all my stuff blow around. Had a load of like a, a backup anyways. And it happened again. And it was like, look at all my stuff. I had it all separated nice in here for the video and all that good stuff. And the wind just took it and threw it all in a corner. Good thing I put up the glass, right? Hmm. Anyhow, uh, let's go and we'll take off this last container. We'll plop it here. And then we'll get rid of the... Um, We'll get rid of this here. So you can deconstruct that. That will go plopping off like that. Uh, you can grab the handle. And then uh, I'll just jetpack up here right quick. Make my life uh, easy. And then we'll drop it down. Grab the wrench. And there. Now it's all fixed. Same thing with this. We'll grab this. Um, I'm, that means I made one container too many. But that's fine. That's fine. Oh, I want to grab you. There we go. Uh, we'll turn my jetpack off. Uh, I believe you got to walk backwards sometimes because uh, it can get a little funky. If I knew where I was going, that would be great. Uh, I think we're in the room now. Excellent. Good. There we go. Now, that can sit there. Uh, we'll go blowing away anywhere. Now, we can go get rid of this thing here. Uh, what do you need? The angle grinder. And... Bam. There we go. So, unfortunately, you get no resources from that, which I think is kind of crap. You should get some kind of thing back for it. I don't know. Some kind of electronics or some stuff like that. So, um, this is the size of the room we're going to build. Um, I need that extra little space right here. So, let's... Uh, do we have this stuff in here? Frames. So oh, yeah. That was the frames. So, I want the frames. Nope. Uh, let's get out of there. So, we'll finish uh, off this room. First things first, right? And then it means, I guess, at one point or another, we're going to have to put walls and stuff on it, like, and kind of start encasing it in, because otherwise we're going to get blown all over the place, right? And we don't want that. Which I find a little bit unrealistic, because they did make it um, a little too... Ooh, a little too, uh, too harsh for the wind. You shouldn't... You shouldn't have that much wind on Mars. But anyways, like, oh, there's only one. Hmm, how come? Uh, oh, is that because, like, I reloaded? Did I forget to make more? Or did I put them elsewhere? That's very plausible. I might have put them elsewhere. Or I just might not have made any. <laughs> like, find me. Oh, here they are. Oh, no, those are for the... No, those are for the wrong one. So I'm going to have to make a whole bunch more. All right, so I'll do that off cam. I'll make a whole bunch more freaking cheats because I think that was right before I saved and uh, when I reloaded so I didn't get enough time to make some sheets all right so that's good so the walls um I do want to see into this place though like I, I wanted to make it look nice I don't want it to be all just like walls and stuff like that so I think the goal is going to be like so, right? We're going to do the window thing. Like, even though we're going to have, like, pipes and all kinds of stuff like that, I think it'd be best if we just do kind of, like, a little window thing. I'm just going to use it to get rid of the parts, everybody. That's the only reason why I'm doing it, planning. And then the gases, because this is what this room is going to be. That's what we're going to get into today is get gases. Because I want to pressurize this place because we only got, like, four chocolate bars left. So we need to make start making food. So that's going to be the plan for this episode. We're going to get into gases. Um, this side is going to be for the harvesting of gases. This side is going to be for the mixing of gases. Um, so in the next episode, we'll do the mixing gases to pressurize our base. So that means we're going to have to do a lot of building and a lot of pressurizing to make sure everything is nice and airtight. Um, that's going to be one thing I'm going to do in between videos. And that's that. So I'm going to get to making all these parts and stop babbling and I'll be right back. All right, I went ahead and I made all the parts so and I welded all that together. So we're going to get into putting where the gas stuff has to go. So we're going to get through my uh, jumbled mess of uh, parts over here. So these things right here, you're going to need uh, six tank connectors. So we're going to go and grab six tank connectors. 
<laughs> it was freaking hilarious. Uh, I wonder, are they damaged? Is that why they're like that? I wonder. Is that like... Oop. That bar is like half full compared to the other one. I wonder why that is. Interesting. Anyways, let's uh, let's have a little turnaround. So I want these things kind of up against the wall. Uh, like so. Oh, no, not like so. Uh, it's just one too far back. Crud. And scrap you back. Yeah, just like that. That's going to be nice. And then we're going to have to separate these a little bit. Uh, I think by one like that. I think that's how I was doing that. Because it kind of turns out to be like one per each. No, I think I had them separated one more. Because uh, I was like kind of like testing stuff out. So I was like looking at how I wanted to build it. That's why some of these big containers are are kind of big there. So let's uh, keep going through our jumbled mess here. This is freaking hilarious. Um, I wish it would have been a little bit more organized than that. But like I said, the wind kind of... Took me for a turn there. I was caught me off so guard, man. Like, and it, it blew me away. It like literally blew me into that hole over there. And I was like, what the heck? I, I was, I couldn't believe it. Four, I got four of them there like that. And then got two more in here somewhere. All right, let's get you uh, over there. I'll try to unbury some stuff here. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna need you. Oh, that's one of them. So I need just one more. Uh, where are you? Where are you? Is that you? That's you. All right, perfect. So now these are going to house your tanks. These are going to have the different kind of gases that we're going to be using. Okay. Um, and then that's it because that was going to be the wall. Perfect. 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 So these are going to house the tanks. Um, I guess I should maybe put the tanks on now since they are kind of finicky. So go ahead and put the tanks on. Uh. Yeah, put the tanks on. Uh, so, oh uh, yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Wish they were a little bit easier to do though. Uh, click. <laughs> you crap. There you go. That was like one of those three hours later moments. So I'm going to go put the rest of them on and I'll be right back. That's nice. There we go. All right. So those are all on. Now we need to get uh, the atmospheric thingamabobbers. These things right here. Uh, these don't stack either. I wonder if that means because they got damaged. They probably did. That really sucks. I wonder if you can fix them. Hmm. I wonder, wonder. All right, so we're going to be loading up the gases from this way, right? So that's an air conditioner. Make sure you choose the right thing. Okay, uh, we want a filtration. Because like if you use the mouse wheel, you can go up and down through different things. So we wanted to make sure we're, we're filtering stuff. So we wanted to make sure we leave a space and we're good here like this. So this is kind of how we want to do things. This is like the input. Uh, your unfiltered gases are going to come out here and your filtered gases are going to come out here. Your filters are going to go in here. So we can color code these later on. I'm not going to too worry about it right now because... Um, mainly the fact I might do the tanks but other than that that's it's that way I don't mix them up later on when we move into our new base but uh, for now I think we're, that's how we're going to do that so I'm going to continue putting these in uh, making sure that they're the filtration system and we're leaving gaps in between so that way we have um, room for pressure buildups and we don't want to blow anything up and at the same time too well we can run our wiring through all the back here too as well so that's a bonus so i'm going to continue doing this and i'll be right back oh that was the furnace 
All right, so those are up and going. So we got those good. Now I think we should uh, maybe connect some pipes. I think that's what we'll do. So I'll connect some pipes. I'll start on this side here. I don't know where I'm going to put the entry in yet, but we'll go here. This has to turn. And then this way I want to put a three-way. Because we're going to want to pull off of every single gas, right? So I think I'm just going to go put a three-way on each one of these right away. Um, I need more pipe. Good thing I got more pipe over here, man. Uh, grab that. And then I'll just put them together afterwards. All right, so now we have uh, all of this hooked up. I'll explain what I got going on here. So we have the furnace here. Uh, the output to the furnace is here. We'll go into our first filtration system. And each one of these will get filtered and go into a storage container. These storage containers also can be uh, pulled out from here. So each one of these, I'm going to have like a... I guess a valve and a smart system hooked up to them eventually. Um, where you can find out what's the contents of each thing and all that good stuff. So we'll we'll eventually do baby steps and set this up like so it's super awesome. But uh, for now, uh, that's what we're going with. Um, then we got all of our filters over here. So we're going to make sure we put the right filters. So we'll start off with these and this. I guess uh, I'll go ahead and place all these filters in. So how do I want this? Carbon. I'll put carbon here. And then I'll go and I'll place the rest and you'll see how everything fits up after. But you don't have to put both filters. You can only have to put one. So if you want to only put one, well then fine. But if you put two, then hoorah. Then you can put two. And that'll work out just fine. Anyways, I'll be back. Okay, so now we have all the canisters in, which is a good thing. So now we have our, these are pollutants, and we got uh, nitrous oxide, and vol volatiles, and carbon dioxide, nitrogen, and oxygen. All right, um, and then with all these things, you can build all kinds of different gases and fuels and kind of stuff like that. So uh what else here uh, this is another thing i wanted to get into today too is i wanted to finish off something i i meant to do last episode as well so when we're done our resources and they're done being created well they would just plop out but once this becomes a wall well we won't be able to do anything about it so we're going to add a, some shoots here and I'm gonna make this one go straight uh corner back to straights I want this to go up top here. Well, I guess we could turn right away, right? Uh, no, corner. There we go. Land a straight. Uh, like this. Like that. Like this. Like this. Uh, I think one more. That's kind of like the middle. No, I want to take that one off. Then we'll put the... I think it's an outlet. Uh, bin outlet. There we go. And then it kind of already points down as it is. So all of our material is just going to fall here on the ground. So I think that's how that's going to be. And it's going to look good. Um, actually, I could have put it up one more, shouldn't I? Have? Yeah, I think I should have. Oh, that's what I'll do. I'll put it up one more and I'll be back. All right. So I think this is the way I'm going to get it. And then that way it pops out and just shoots out onto the floor like that. I think that's perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So now that we have this gas set up, uh, we'll be able to start using this. And uh, whatever gases get uh, uh, made in here, well, we'll be able to push out. Uh, I just kind of messed up one thing, though. Um, I do need a valve on this. I think we're going to put one... Uh, probably right here, I think, the best place to put that. Uh, I did forget that. Because otherwise we want to be able to uh, control the flow, right? Of, um, of what we're doing. So, yeah. Otherwise we'll have no idea. All of our stuff will be constantly going through and we'll never be able to, to send it off, right? So, which way is which here? Um... They're both pluses. <laughs> okay, so 
Let's go like this. Oh, that's the wrong way. Just the wrong way. Just the wrong way. So what do you have to do to get that off? Can you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Perfect. So. Oh, that's not good. A little bit like that. Yes, that's exactly how it should be. Because that is off. That is on. That's perfect. All right. So now we have a valve controlling this, and that way we can keep our our heat and all that good stuff in there. And then when we're done with it, we can release it into here, and it can go get uh, placed in all the gases. And that's that. So in the, in the next episode, um, I think what we'll do is we'll finish off the base. We'll uh, enclose it all up, and then we'll be getting ready for pressure, and then... Yeah, I think that's it. So there's going to be a lot of base building next episode. Uh, a little bit of designing and all that good stuff. Um, and then that way we can get our base pressurized. Um, that way we can work on our airlock system that's going to be right here. And I might do another airlock system right here. Just because I want our grow room to be a little bit different in climate than what's out here. So we'll have like a little bit maybe of a smart system out here. Uh, we'll see how that works out. Uh, but yeah, that's it for today, everybody. Hope you enjoyed the video. This is the beginning of our gas setup. Um, this is what's going to help us mix our gases and all that good stuff. And so on this side, we're going to, like I said, we're going to do our gas mixture next time. So we'll do our gas mixture for the oxygen and the nitrogen. That's going to be our setup that's going to go right here. And this is what's going to fuel our our base and keep it pressurized so that way we can breathe on the inside. Uh, yeah, it's going to be great. I hope you enjoyed the video, everybody. Like, subscribe, and we'll see you next time.